quick video on this Hitachi uh, media box for a Hitachi plasma television I believe. Now this one is a victim of dog pee. Uh, the dog has pissed on it and um, it's got onto the power supply and onto the digital board. And the immediate fault was the fuse was blown on the power supply. So I began looking for short circuits and what I found here, I won't test it now, but basically uh, this bridge rectifier here for the standby power has a dead short between live and neutral and between live negative and neutral negative. Uh, between live positive and live um, and other live uh, and neutral positive it is, is fine. Uh, so if we look at this uh, diagram of a bridge rectifier we can see if it has that, those two diodes down there are likely short. Yeah, if that one failed short first then on the next conduction cycle that might be subject to excessive current surge and blow that one out too. Um, not entirely sure why uh, urine would um, <coughs> do so much damage, so there might be additional faults on there. It's a pretty old unit, it's pretty hard to get a replacement for, so guys fairly um, would be fairly happy if it could get it working again. Uh, it doesn't look like it has HDMI or anything on it, so I guess it's for an older plasma, or the HDMI might be on the TV itself. Uh, it's just 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 got a SCART a component video and an analog tuner, no free view. And uh, it's got a DVI and VGA, but uh, the DVI is to the TV. I think the VGA might be an input, but I'm not certain. Um, what I did when I was tracing down the fault, because there's, there's a standby bridge and there's a main bridge here. Uh, and so it could be either at fault, but I realise there's a relay here which clicks in the power to the main bridge. There's a dead short across this live neutral here, which is why this fuse here popped. But there's also another fuse here, and that's okay. Now that's a two amp rated, that's four amp rated. So this, yeah, it's 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 not always guaranteed, but that would usually blow first um, if there was a short, and that hasn't. Uh, that's across the uh, that's from the capacitor to the uh, um, transformer which goes into the drain this is a massive power supply for what it's doing really and it's a two layer PCB as well it's a little over the top but anyway so it's certainly not a cheap unit, uh, new I guess um, additionally I uh, uh, well, noticed that uh, this fuse popped but this fuse hadn't um, which means this side is probably okay. Um, apparently also a Xena diode down there commonly fails. Uh, I might have to have a look at that. I think that's been replaced before. Um, that's basically a little diagnosis of the fault. Um, when you're opening it, be careful with the ribbon cable which goes uh, from this board to the DVI and, and so on uh, board, the video board. Uh, because it can, the clip can break if you're not careful. Uh, this unit is made in Japan, I think, so it's obviously pretty old. Hitachi don't even make their own stuff anymore. Hitachi AV3000E. Um, they mostly farm out to Vestel now. I don't think they make any of their TVs anymore. Uh, so that's it, I think.